keep saying that so y'all can listen because I know some of y'all like me, y'all not going to get on the first time, so I'm going to keep saying it. What's good, y'all? This is day one from the deep conditioner. As you can see, still look the same as yesterday. We still got a little bush going, but don't you worry now. It's gonna look better, it's gonna look better. And you know what we gotta do, that LCO method, you already know. So you know I always start with my leave-in. And since I just got the shower, I usually always kind of wet my hair and just let it air dry a little bit before I start. But so, <clears throat> I usually start with a little bit and I make sure that like, I start with the tips, why? Because they're the ones more likely to have breakage. Yeah, they're more farther from the root. The root more, is more healthier because it just came out your scalp and all that. So always start with the tips first. And um, my hair is long enough for me to like, you know, section it off, but I'm not gonna do that. See, it's easier to do today than like yesterday because like the hair was freshly washed. This like the first day after a wash. You guys see like the second day after the wash because it looks really, really good. Like I said, you take care of your hair, take care of you. Pretty much it. And I think that's pretty much a good amount. I don't really need that much of it. Like I said, always listen to your hair because it will definitely tell you what it needs. And if it says it's dry, then you might need some water. So if it's saying that it don't hold moisturizer like that, then you need a sealant, a better sealant. So like a better oil or a better shea butter. If it keeps breaking, multi suit, but we'll get into that in a different video. Next part is curl cream so you can pretty much use any conditioner that you choose to um i personally just like mia because mia is a thick has a very thick cream um as well as i just like it like it just really makes my hair very very soft and yeah so again i always start with the tips Y'all yeah, know what we're talking about, start with the tips. I'm gonna put it on the sides too, cause if y'all like me, y'all don't got no sides, y'all still gotta take care of them. Don't forget about them sides. You don't want your hair to look good, but it's your sides looking crusty. Girls don't like that. Same thing, same method. And why I just really freeform it is just because I mean, that's just how, I personally think that's how my hair is supposed to be. I don't need to like comb it off and do all that extra stuff. Like I'll take the time and just go through it because when you go through it, you taking your time with it. And um, you know, you really like seeing what your hair can do versus you sectioning it off and you just putting it through and going quick and moving on with your day. Like take your time with it, like you know, like, as you, like, look, my hair is, I ain't gonna say, like, it's not the best, but at the same time, every time I take care of it, it looks really, really good. And the more you take care of it, it's like your hair get used to it. Like, you gotta train your hair, you feel me? And, like, after, like, you finish training it, you know, sometimes you can kick back. Like, say you go on vacation or something, or... I don't want to give y'all bad habits, but I'm just saying, like, we all have our moments where we forget or we just get caught up and we don't do our hair, which is perfectly fine. Some days we don't even need to do our hair, but if you forget to do your hair sometimes, if your hair is trained, it's like, you know, training your muscles. It's not going to, you're not going to lose muscle on the first day, but after, like, maybe the first, second week, third week, you know, yo. Yeah. It is given you need that treatment. No, I'm just playing. The reason why this process is easy for me personally um, is because if you watched yesterday's video, if you did, I'll leave it in the uh, 
drop down link. But I just deconditioned my hair and like, yeah, I'm still having breakage, but I'm not having breakage like normally because not only did I decondition it, but I also added like ingredients into it that put back moisture into it. So I did go to the gym today. So that also um, like, I don't know if it hydrates my hair, but it definitely gets it like wet. So I guess it hydrates it. But you know, for the most part, um, yeah, my hair usually, if I don't take care of it, it's very, very dry and brittle. And it looks good from the outside, but you touch it and it breaks. Oil, 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 oil. So again, I listen to my hair, right? So keep saying that, see so how I can listen. Cause I know some of y'all like me, y'all not gonna get on the first time. So I'm gonna keep saying, I'm gonna do this mint oil today. You know, I'm feeling, I'm feeling groovy. You know, I did a deconditioner yesterday. So, um, yo, we're gonna use this mint oil. And I put a little oil, you don't need a lot of oil. You don't want your hair greasy now. You don't want your, You don't want that, sir. This is not the 1980s. And you are not coming to America. <laughs> so this time I really start from the root and go to the tip. Like, more so because like I pretty much did the work putting in all the other products in terms of the leave-in and the cream. So I do both in this method, but I also change it up sometimes just to, you know, freak it on my hair for a little bit. Make sure that you're moving forward, backwards, left and right, because I hear it's curly, y'all. It don't matter if you're 4A, 4B, 4C, hell, 3C. You know what I'm saying? And even if you don't feel like your hands, your hands are oily, they're oily. So just keep going. If you didn't add enough, you could put maybe a little bit more, but you really don't need that much oil. Look at that. I gotta let y'all see the definition. Ooh. Too good. And I'm, I'm gonna be honest, I don't really style my hair for for Like, I really just put my hair in the direction it grows. So, this side goes that way, this side goes down, or back, down, back. This side goes to the right. And I don't know what this side do, so I just really play with it. But sometimes my hair go down, so be doing like weird stuff. Since this is like freshly washed hair, I'm probably going to do maybe a twist out soon. So stay tuned for that. And I'll switch up my twist out. Sometimes I do two strands, sometimes I do three strands. Like I, I flat twist sometimes, you feel me? So stay tuned, stay tuned, stay tuned. Oh, oh, get into it, get into it, get into it. Basically, we doing that so your hair is moisturized. It's not so, I mean, if I wanted to style it, I'm probably going to like, you know, do, like I said, twist, um, style gel. I do a lot of things. So, um, heck, I'm even going to color my hair again because people was like, you know, why you start coloring your hair? And I'm like, I don't know. I was, I was liking the mature look, you know, I got the beard. I got the, got the hair, you know, I don't look my age. So, um, you know, I was enjoying life, but, um, with that being said, yeah. She coming today, so I gotta go. But um, like I said, I'm gonna show y'all again what it look like later, my fault. But y'all be smooth out here in these streets. Make sure y'all leave a like, 
comment if y'all got any questions, comments, or concerns, or what products y'all need. Woo woo woo. Um, subscribe to your boy, cause how we gonna make this comment with content? <laughs> subscribe, subscribe to what? What are you doing? What are you doing? All right, y'all. Peace.